Exercise 1.28. In this exercise, we will introduce a new function. You have already mastered quite a few, but now there's a new one that's quite useful. It's called today. And using the function of today will show you the date of today. Here we go. And you actually don't need to write any argument in the function. You just need to start today and open parentheses, then close parentheses, then you are ready to go. There's also another alternative called now, but with this function, you will also get the time. The time is not always useful. In this case, we need to calculate the number of the days have been passed. So here we have, say, this is a date sent, and this is the date of today. And we can easily calculate how many days have been passed. One of the ways to calculate is to use the date of today minus the date that was sent. So yes, you can also do a mathematical calculation with the dates. So here you go, you have 81 days passed. And if we fix that, fix A1 to a cell by the row and drag this one downwards, you will have all the data. And the other way is to use the day 360 or oh, day 360 function. And the starting date is of course the date that was sent and the end date will be the date of today. Oh, we missed a day. So you see there could be a calculation error that you know, if you choose to uh, to use the calculation or you choose to use the day 360, there might be a minor difference. And in this case, uh, let's see if we need to lock this, lock A1 and move it downwards. We have the same data received. Let's check uh, to see if we get the same result as the screenshot on the syllabus shows. With that, we need to change this uh, date to 20th April of 2020. Before I go there, I just want to remind you one more thing about today. With this function, even if you open up the Excel sheet tomorrow, the date will still show the date of today, which is tomorrow. So you will always receive the updated date if you use the today function. So let's move on and change the date to 20th April um, 2020 and see all these days are matching on the snow with a screenshot on the syllabus. So that is exercise 1.28. I will see you in the very last exercise of next video.